Got some of the day. So doing a size comparison, that's how big these two boxes are compared, although the Gladiator is already pre-assembled and the Pro is not. So the tires are vented, the wheels are vented rather. Very soft and will take on water. Pretty cool looking. I like how it has a throttle limit. Pretty cool for a stock remote. Okay, pretty cool looking, not bad. First thing I want to do is a size comparison. <clears throat> Here is the new SCX-10-3 Gladiator compared to a 
VS410 Pro. I modified that obviously, but that's how much longer the wheelbase is. Much bigger the vehicle the vehicle is. Slightly bigger. A little bit more flex for sure. Especially with the portals. Those tires are tucking. So that's with the Pro. You guys, we got some wildlife show in the background. Okay, and this is my TRX4. Let's see what the wheelbase difference is on this. Ground clearance wise with portals. You can definitely tell the axial has higher higher ground clearance. <clears throat> I custom made this truggy, so it might have a little bit more. Not bad, seems about the same. Tires are one nine XL size, so that's good. One thing I've been wanting to know and have asked on Axial's Facebook page is I like how these body clips aren't on top of the body. That's nice. Is what size is the motor? Might be on the box. <clears throat> Thirty-five turn motor. <clears throat> Excuse me, I've been working outside all day. Body clips aren't bad being recessed like they are. Make sure you get the whole body. With the Lamborghini leg lock on this bitch. So these are the first upgrade. I've got some Vanquish Products KMC Bully 19s with 
Super shafty disc brakes, the black 375 hubs from Vanquish, and the Trinidad rings from JEC Racing with Crawler Innovations foam and Proline Crawler TA tires. Yeah, that looks a lot more trail ready. Okay, here is my 2 2 Wraith that has been stretched because I flipped these to get a little bit longer wheelbase and so a little bit lower both front and rear and JK has about the same wheelbase as this which if you center the wheel I guess this would go a little bit further forward so it's about the same but still It looks so cool. All right, <clears throat> so got the first upgrades. You can't see if you can tell over top of that tire right there that there is not a stub hanging out of these stock wheels, but it does not look cool. Some crawler innervation foams in there. Sealed, no holes in those tires. That's compared to a stock tire. Not as much give, no air holes. No water coming in. Yeah. 